<sighs> Good morning. What is up? It's the last chat, and today we're going on an adventure. So first, I'm gonna get myself some breakfast. I'm gonna get myself ready, and we're gonna get ourselves on the road all the way to Tafranui. If you guys don't know where Tafranui is, you have to check it out. It's an amazing beach, just a little bit up north, maybe an hour and hour and a half, just out of the city where I live, which is Auckland. So we're going to go enjoy some sun, enjoy some pizza, and just have a fun day. But first, we've got to get our breakfast in, and we've got to get our training in. So let's get to it. Physique update, if you guys haven't noticed, I'm on a bit, I'm on a bit of a cut at the moment. So, you know, feeling a little bit, a little bit shredded. Still working on that last little bit of fat over here and hair coming off. Got those legs popping through a little bit. Feeling a little bit small, but, you know, at least we'll work with that. And we'll see how things go. All right, let's get this breakfast, baby. Oh, that was easy. Now, let's go get this breakfast. So, as you can see, we've got something for breakfast. We've got two pieces of toast, strawberry and raspberry jam, a uh, little bit of butter, you know, just for the extra calories. We've got ourselves a calorie shake. I've got peanut butter. i got yogurt. i got almond milk. Uh, sorry, coconut milk. Two scoops away, and I was going to chuck in some oats, but unfortunately I ran out of oats, so that's a bit annoying, but it is what it is. At least I'm getting my calories in, and at least I'm getting my macros and protein, so you know I can't complain. We're going to smash this down, and then we're going to go get a push session, and he's going to get a crazy, crazy chest pump right before we go to the beach. So, you know, looking nice and dice for the ladies, uh, even though it's pretty cloudy, it's pretty bismal outside. I don't really care. I'm just out for the adventure and I'm going to have the funnest day today. So tag along with me and see what we get up to. Hundred twenty five grams of carbs, 48 grams of fats and 87 grams of protein. Now this is a large meal, but it will keep me going through my workout and even maybe some into the day, and I have a little snack before lunch. Let's get to it. All right, so the first exercise, I've done a little warm up, getting the blood flowing nice and juicy. We're gonna be hitting a five by five bench. Now this one is really situated around building as much strength as you can in this workout, so don't be afraid to let loose a little bit, you know? Keep your form nice and good, but make sure you're pushing yourself on that bench, because that's when that chest is really gonna grow. Let's get to it. All right, so the next exercise we're gonna be doing is a 10 minute EMOM of ring dips. Now an EMOM means every minute on the minute. So we're gonna be doing 10 minutes, so 10 sets of ring dips, and you're trying to hit five to eight. Really strict, keep the form nice and tight, and just burn out that chest. This is gonna absolutely kill you, and at the end of it, you won't even be able to use your arms properly. So let's get it. So the next exercise is an incline dumbbell bench. So we're gonna go three sets, we're gonna go to failure on all the sets, aim for about 12 to 14 reps, get a nice weight that you can really rip up and feel like at the same time. By this stage your chest is gonna be absolutely blasted. So just try and get the contraction, try and feel your muscle mind connection and hit it hard because this is absolutely killer. Alright, so the next exercise is gonna be a super set. Running out of it a little time, so you know we gotta make sure that we get shit done. So we're going to be doing is dumbbell flies on a flat bench. This is one of Arnold's favorite exercises. And you know, I aspire to be like Arnold, so you got to hit that one too. So it's three sets, 14 reps for the dumbbell that you can actually contract your pecs with. And make sure that you don't go too low because you don't want to compromise your shoulders. We're going to be supersetting this with overhead skull crushes for the dumbbell. So that one also is three sets and it's going to be about 12 to 14 reps. So really blow these triceps out and really start getting that nice, juicy, juicy pit pec hang. So keep to it and watch this, let's get it done. So 
We have done the workout. We have finished our push workout. This is our upper body one. As you can see, the chest and the shoulders are looking nice and full. Oh, those triceps are popping. So good, baby! There's a sickening, sickening little tricep pump there. So like I said, enough about me being egotistical. It is time for us to leave the gym. Let's go get some food and then let's head up to Tapper and we've got a little secret for you. This is a vlog. We're going to be making sure that we go for a road trip. So stay tuned and you're going to see one of the nicest beaches in Auckland. Well, actually, it's just outside of Auckland by an hour. But anyway, let's get to it, baby. Woo! We are on the way, probably about 40 minutes out from now. Um, I look white as hell in this frame. I have no clue why. I cannot seem to adjust the ISO and the aperture on this camera properly for the light that's coming in from the window. Um, but it's just going to have to do. I'm going to be leaning forwards and watching the road so that I don't crash and kill us both. Um, So we have reached the beach and now we need to refeed, you know, like it's been a long drive, you know, depleting the calories, depleting the carbs. So we've got ourselves our next little snack, 40 grams of protein. This stuff tastes absolutely disgusting, tastes like perfume, but it doesn't matter because it's protein and you know what protein does, it builds those muscles, baby. <laughs> Last Chad just got back. That drive was very, very hard to stay awake. I am pretty exhausted, not gonna lie. So I'm just gonna settle down at the end of the day. You know, we got home about an hour and a half drive back in traffic in peak hour, which was pretty relentless and not gonna lie, very draining, stimulating the brain at like seven at night after a full day of sun exposure to the gym and gains. So I'm feeling pretty, pretty fatigued. But we have ourselves our fifth and final meal for the day now this consists of a steak some rice some tomato that has been planched and boiled um, and some condiments in the rice which is in the sort of carrots and some celery and all sorts of things so it's a very colorful meal very delicious meal but that is going to wrap it up for today. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. If you enjoyed it, please like, subscribe to the channel, share it with your friends and family and cared loved ones. It would be hugely appreciated. As I said before in my previous videos, thank you so much for the support, all 129 of you subscribers. I love every single one of you. So I'm going to keep putting content out. If you guys have any recommendations, chuck it down in the comments below. It would be hugely appreciated if you could just help the brother out the last chad needs advice if you could show some love just love and just give it to them other than that chad saving you one rep at a time baby hope you enjoyed the day vlog see you next time